question number 3 of exercise 13.3 curved surface area of a cone is 308 cm square and its slant height is 14 cm find radius of the base and total surface area of the cone here we have to find two things one radius of the base and second total surface area of the cone now see in the question we are given value of curved surface area of a cone okay and we are asked to find radius of the base we know that the curved surface area of a cone is equal to pi r l so we'll put that formula because we are given the value of curved surface area and then we'll find radius of the base curved surface area of a cone is equal to 308 centimeter square slant height l is 14 centimeter now when first we have to find radius for that we will put formula of curved surface area what is the formula of curved surface area of a cone Curved surface area of the cone is equal to pi r l. It is given as 308. So, we will write 308 is equal to pi r l. Now, we want to find value of radius that is r. Therefore, r will be equal to what? This pi and l are in multiplication with r. So, we have to remove both from this side. So, when it goes on left hand side, it will become denominator because here they are in multiplication. Therefore, R will be equal to 308 divided by pi L. Next step will be R is equal to 308 divided by value of pi 22 divided by 7 into L. Slant height is given as 14. Okay. Now, this 7 is in denominator. Here, it will go in multiplication. Therefore, R is equal to 308 into 7 divided by 22 into 14. Now, 7 2 za 14 308 divided by 2 so 2 into 154 that gives us 308 so 308 divided by 2 is 154 now we are left with 154 divided by 22 so 22 into 7 that is 154 154 okay so, we got answer R is equal to 7. Other measurements are in centimeter. So, radius R will also be centimeter. So, radius we got as 7 centimeter. Now, in second we have to find the total surface area of the cone. So, we'll put the formula total surface area of the cone is equal to pi r in bracket r plus l let us put the value pi is 22 divided by 7 r is 7 in bracket r is 7 plus l that is 14 so in the next step the 7 and 7 get cancelled so, we have 22 multiplied with 7 plus 14. That is what? 21. So, 22 into 21. That gives us 462. Multiplication of 22 and 21 gives us 462. What will be the unit? All the measurements are in centimeter and this is area. So, to centimeter square 
answer in sentence will write therefore the total surface area of the given cone is 462 centimeters square so this is question number 3